Hi guys, welcome to another Windows tutorial. Today we're going to look at how to install Active Directory Domain Services and DNS on Windows Server 2008. So to get started, open the Server Manager, ok now click on Roles, then click on Add Roles. Okay, now have a quick read through this page to make sure you have everything that it asks for and click next to continue. Now from this list tick Active Directory Domain Services and hit next. Have a quick read through this first page and click next. and click install that could just serve a, a few minutes to install Active Directory domain services Ok now it's finished, click close this wizard and launch the Active Directory Domain Services wizard dcpromo.exe Ok now click next, read through this to see if it, any of it matters to you, if not you can carry on and click next, click create a new domain in a new forest. Now give the wizard a domain name you want to use. So for example I'll use wthd.local and then click next. Ok now select a functional level, if you are going to use all Windows Server 2008 servers you can select Windows Server 2008, if you have some Windows Server 2003 servers select Windows Server 2003 and if you have some Windows 2000 servers then select Windows 2000 but for this demonstration I'm going to select Windows Server 2008. So now I'll give you a little warning letting you know about what you're going to do. So now click next to continue the wizard. Ok now make sure that you leave this ticked and click next. When this window pops up click yes. Ok, leave these all as default and click next to continue. Enter a restore mode password. This doesn't have to be the same as the administrator password but it should be one that you can remember and it should be also a strong password. Ok, click next to continue. Ok, if you haven't entered a complex password it will ask you to do this. It will ask you to do it again. OK, click next again. OK, click next to continue. And wait for Active Directory and DNS to install.
Okay, now it's finished. Click finish. And then click restart now. And wait for the server to restart. Okay, now the server is ready again. Press Ctrl Delete to log on. Okay, now the server's finished loading, you'll see that in the server manager. And under role summary, you see you have DNS and Active Directory domain services installed. That's it for this tutorial. Look out for more coming soon when we'll be looking at installing DHCP on Windows Server 2008.